Hello, map readers. This is the Battle of the Bulge, the episode of Rock Rare Commentaries, Call of Duty, World War II. It's Christmas. We're digging into It's Christmas. Forced in Belgium. So cold, we're pissing ice cubes. Gonna be one hell of a fight. Hmm. And on the other side, on, on the other front, the uh, Russians and Germans are playing soccer. Right. With Turner gone, we lost our... Saying who's going to play... <laughs> who's going to kick Adolf Hitler's head into the goal? Now that Pearson's in charge, I may not come home at all. Merry Christmas, Turner. Oh, and Turner. Pearson made farm boy over here a corporal. I wonder what you think of that. Probably that you're the same old sack of shit, Aiello. This ain't the time. To Turner. To Turner. 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 No sacrifice too great. Lucky son of a bitch. You're always first, right? And he got the booze. Yeah, I get your jollies tonight, boys, because tomorrow when that convoy comes through, you're gonna be on the front line defending it. And Turner's not gonna be there. Easy. Easy. And he's drunk. <laughs> Corporal now, huh? Yo, yo. Said no. Mm. Six years I served with them. Six. Merry fucking Christmas. Sure thing, Mr. Mm. Garrison. Pearson, it's not our fault that he had a hero's complex. <laughs> of course, I've got my the character I'm playing has as a hero's complex. Convoy's coming. And it's up to us to make sure it gets to the Rhine. Wow, those All tanks are uh, actually booking at the same speed as the trucks are. I didn't think that they could do that. Well, you gotta be going that speed if you anticipate you're gonna be running over skeletons. Alright, I know that they're not actually allowed to have a fire here because the smoke gives away their sit their uh, area, but come on. They they, they need some sort uh, they need some sort of additional warmth because it's actively fucking snowing. Well they need um <clears throat> they probably had to double up on rations if possible, so their own metabolism can just keep them more by working double time. In addition to foxhole syndrome, which was a uh, a real condition that was taking the lives of soldiers who were just waiting in the foxhole for something to happen, as they actually depleted their resources to the point of death. Which I may have described in earlier parts. Delivery. Walking with the box. Hmm. All the way over here. And we get to dramatically walk past all these actors. Mm, so many different foxholes. I'm delivering an ammo box to you, you inaccurate person, you. <laughs> That's a nice tree. Oh, it's everybody's favorite time. It is slow down time. Boink! Boink them. That's right. Fuck yourselves. Boink! Remember to take a deep breath, always. That one's already down. Miss. That one actually hit. There you go. With the Lee Enfield, anything is possible. Almost. I mean, you can't. I don't think you could actually load the uh, Lee Enfield with an explosive round. So 
He thought I couldn't see him. I could. Oh, yes, I could. Back to Pearson. Uh, excuse me, balls. Um, uh, <clears throat> well, excuse we me, We only made seventy-five percent of our shots count, Pearson. Is that going to be a problem? Uh, sir, you there? There's really no need to talk about my mother like that, uh, sir. Uh, sir. So I can't actually tell what his accent is from here. Well, who, um, our, our, our new friend here? Yeah. I mean, he's not, it sounds like he could be from New York. All right, new friends. I like protect the convoy. Um, um, yeah. Okay, so our, our job is to escort the uh, convoy of Shermans. Our job is to do what the game says, or else it'll give us a restart on the checkpoint. <laughs> huh. Oh look! The, oh look! We failed to protect the convoy. I guess that m means we're gonna have to restart. Darn it! Well, thanks to the mat, thanks to my magical editing skills, there's no telling how many times it took me to get this right. I think this this was a first attempt. Tree. Jesus Christ. Oh Christmas tree, oh Christmas tree, why are you falling on the top of me? No, uh, because that's what rockets do, Mr. Crown. You all right? No, that's a tree above my face, and its branches are sticking into my model. Oh, these these guys have met death already multiple times. Just say no to death. You would not think right that now. they would actually keep his calling card on hand, but they choose not to. Right. Okay, so we're having so we're having squad tensions now. Timing, timing. Get to the radio. <laughs> so this is the uh, mad dash that would uh, be relatively famous in Star Wars Battlefront Two. Yeah. Quick, you gotta pull it out from under the broken down picket fence. Take a nice Boink. deep breath. Pray, say a prayer to God. My strength, my shield, and he in whom I trust. Mm. You were an easy target. Back at home because my mom said it was too big to carry on the plane. Ah. These fools have no idea. Oh, these guys know where I am. I got a. I have a gift for you. A bullet to your brain. So I keep it's 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 Chris it's Christmas. I, of course, I'm gonna keep singing Christmas carols. <laughs> Pop the helmet off his head with a single sniper round to the face. Shooting at other heads and making their helmets do a dance. Shooting mm. this guy in the back of his head. Shooting this guy in the back of his head. And speaking of air support, in the next part, uh, we're going to be uh, flying an airplane. No, we doing the AC-130 mission again? No, not the AC-130. More like Crash Bandicoot 3 Mad Bombers. Stay tuned, everybody. Rings of power. Be safe, everyone.